Part of keeping your engine bay clean also means clean hands and less stuff that gets thrown in your eye when you're working on things. Part of the products we carry in your standard stores are an inexpensive engine degreaser, you have your B33 degreaser, and then your gunk products. We have two heavy duties, standard formula, well it's still heavy duty, but standard spray and then gel. And we're going to see how they compare. Uh, side note, these two products, they need to be cool and our engine is slightly warm. And these two products require the engine bay to be warm. So we will both compare them all in the same playing field, even though we said that might hamper the results, but that's just where we're starting with. All right, so we're going to test our four products here on this spot, this spot, this spot, and this spot right here. So we're going to get before. So that's what we're dealing with. So this will be the spray can, the heavy duty gel, standard original, B33, and cheap Walmart brand on these little parts right here. I'm also just going to get general areas like back here, do general regions with certain products. See how things turn out. And underneath the engine bay, we're also going to get some cleaning. Alright, so we started our timer, the gel and the spray went on nice. P33 is pretty powerful, and then this is actually a foam, I didn't know that. The greaser is actually foam, so cheap blue bottle. Smells kind of funky. That's how to protect the distributor wires, but we're gonna ignore that. And yeah, try some back here. Okay, the test is slightly inconclusive, but we can find some results. Let's take a look. And what I mean by that is none of them entirely worked as specified. Now, I definitely see how improvement on all four, but not enough to say, yes, it's cleaning. What's strange is I sprayed the gel all along here And on this part, you see there's still quite a lot of residue. Now this has been on there for a while. And I resprayed above the uh, cylinders, above the... Uh, I also resprayed above the spark plugs, each product. And now I wiped the top half there to give an idea of what can clean. So, what do we think? Engine degreaser from Walmart, junk. The Super Tech, I take that back. It's not junk. It does something, but we sprayed it on here, saw little to no results. Saw little to no results there. Little to no results back here. Inside, they're fine. It did clean up some, so it's not worthless, but it, for what it's intended, it's not ideal. The B33 is either the winner or the runner up. I, I think it's the winner. It's probably the Best bang for your buck. 16 ounces for three dollars. This was five dollars. This is four fifty. This is three dollars. So same price, far better. I think if you the Berrymans, 
V33 uh, engine degreaser is the way to go. And I don't know, by looking at these four real quick, this also appears to be the shiniest. I know that's inconclusive, but it also did the best job here in taking out the residue. So that's that's the Walmart. That's Bear Man's. Now this is the interesting part. This is the gunk product. This is the original. Uh, this can, Engine Bright original, engine degreaser, heavy duty. It's the heavy duty. And then this is the gel. Now clearly, these bottles look a lot better. So does, around here, ignoring the rust, there's actually very little grease remaining, and that is Bearman's B33. So I'm glad I picked this up. Didn't have a price on it, I thought I'd just buy it. It said it's three bucks, and uh, that's the one I'm gonna be buying in the future. All right, thanks guys. And so last place, second to last, second place, first place.